and welcome. I just want to make a quick video showcasing off um, something that I've been building uh, for the past few days in Minecraft. Um, I'll give you a little bit of a backstory on it. Um, I started a new world and I was looking for some place that looked pretty cool that I could build a house around. Um, I walked around, found this desert area with a lava pit in the middle. I thought, yeah, that's that's quite interesting. I'll build a house around that and have that in the middle of my house and it'll look really cool. And then I thought to myself, why build a house when you can build a castle? So that is what I decided to do. Um, as you can probably tell, it is a sand castle. Um, it's made entirely out of sand and sandstone. Um, and I've spent a hell of a long time, more, more time than I would care to admit, um, building this. Taken a while, put it that way, and I've got through quite a few tools as well because I've I've not found any iron yet, so I'm using stone tools, and they don't last very long at all. So it has been quite frustrating at times, but I believe that the um, the result has paid off. As in popped out, it isn't quite finished yet. It's in fact it's a very very long way from being finished. Um, but th 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 this is just a basic structure which has been outlined. I decided um, to build a couple turrets to either side and you can probably see the startings of a bridge just there which will eventually go all the way across and connect to that one there possibly with um, little staircases going off maybe into the courtyard area here uh, the centerpiece of the courtyard is these here there are that that well that that is the lava pit that I found it wasn't all square like that, it was um, it was all raggedy and untidy, so I tidied it up and made it all square. Put these um, steps over it and surrounded it with four pools of water. Um, I wanted them all nice and symmetrical. Um, I just thought it would look cool with a lava pool surrounded by water pools. And I I may put something up here. Um, it looks a bit barren at the moment. Um, I don't know what yet though. I have no idea. I haven't really thought that far ahead. Um, the thing that took the most amount of time, to be honest, are these edges. Because it was originally looking a little bit like that. Um, all the sand cascading down into the water. But I spent a very, very long time doing this. Getting it all leveled off, nice and straight, all the way along. Obviously I haven't quite finished doing that yet. But um, this side I have finished because um, I thought it would be nice um, to look down there and you can see the water kind of like a moat all the way around. Um, and I've I've done that all the way around, or at least I started to do that all the way around. See, I've uh, I've I've made a good start on this side because um, this entire section was like, like I said, look, looking like that with sand cascading down. I'll get around to finish then finishing that at some point is not my um my main priority at the minute. I want to finish the inside first. Um as you can see this courtyard is looking a little bit barren. Um so I want to put a lot of stuff here. I want a mage tower because you can't have a castle without having a mage tower. Because that just wouldn't be right. So it's gonna have a mage tower somewhere. And I'll show you inside these turrets. There's um there's not a lot going on at the moment in it but um, I'll show you here and I, they, there will eventually be a staircase leading up to that so that I can actually get to the bridge but for now every single time I want to go up there I'm just having to do this and go up that way I may extend this out have it three blocks wide so that I can put fences to either side just so I don't fall off um, like I said, it will eventually go all the way along to there as well. Um, so I need to make myself some more sandstone. And I may have something coming down in the middle as well. Maybe an archway um, coming from these bridges. And I'll show you down here as well. Um, as well as having them connected via that. Actually, I'll just show you here real quick as well. Um, ladders going up to the top of this. Nothing much going on here yet at all. Um, but again, like I say, I'm, I'm a long way from completion. And I'm not sure exactly what I'm going to put up there, if anything. Um, but as well as having that bridge, I've created a pathway down here. 
which also links the turrets. It's go it, it goes underneath these stairs that you saw in the middle, which are roughly there, um, and then goes all the way up to the other turret here. You can see I haven't quite finished these steps yet, and I still need to sort out um, like the, these edges. I, I need to put the walls in. It hasn't fully got the walls in it yet. What I intend to do is have offshoots from here and have like a whole network of rooms and corridors underneath the castle as well as on top of it which I thought could be quite cool um, I'm not quite sure how deep I can go there that there may very well be a cave underneath me um, and I have absolutely no idea how far down that lava goes so whilst I'm mining that out I may very well set myself on fire but um, if I do come across the lava I can always block it off and maybe snake around it to either side um, we can see, but I want to have maybe some kind of dungeon down there, I guess. Serves no real real purpose apart from being cosmetic, obviously, but um, it'd be nice to have like a few different kind of buildings and structures around here, because as, as you can see, like I said, it is currently looking a bit plain. Um, whether or not I'll make the whole thing out of sand, I don't know, I, I probably will, to be honest. Um, and maybe find some other ways of adding colour. Um, maybe have some flowers around. I will mind a few trees actually, maybe in 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 the courtyard, um, just to kind of like flesh the place out a little bit. And um, I should point out as one. Well, I started this world as a survival world. Um, th th this isn't in creative mode at all. So I've been having to find all the um, resources to build this. On, on my own by going out in the world uh, but what, what what I've done is until I've actually got this built I've decided to put the game on peaceful which means that no monsters will spawn um, it's I, I, I guess it's cheating in a way but um, I don't want to do all this work and then have a creeper come along and blow it up before I've even got a chance to to finish it so once this is finished which may take a while to be honest um, then I will play some uh, some survival mode gameplay in it using this as my base um, but that, that that may very well be a long way off yet but what I'm going to do I'm going to um, provide updates when whenever I make any kind of sig uh, significant update to the uh, to the castle um, whenever I've done like a fairly um, large amount of work I'll probably put up a look a quick video update uh, just showing you how I'm getting along with it um, by all means if you have any suggestions uh, pop them in the comment box below um, because I haven't fully decided exactly what I'm doing yet um, there's a hell of a lot of space that I can fill well not not, not a huge amount but a, a moderate amount of space that I can fill um, so any suggestions are welcome and will be, ta uh, uh, will be taken on consideration um, so yeah, let me know what you think. Write uh, comments in the uh, section below. And please, if you like this video, please click on the like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done so. Um, I have quite a lot of videos on there, as uh, as you're probably aware. Um, all kinds of gameplay video game gameplay videos. Um, something there for everyone should be. So please subscribe, check it out. And I will see you next time.